Miss Grace and today I'm going to read the Bible story. Today's the Bible title is 7 chapter God Help Joseph Genesis 7 uh, 37 to 41. Jacob had 12 sons but he loved Joseph the most. He gave Joseph the best clothes. He gave him the most delicious food. One day, Joseph had a dream. and his dream, he became a ruler over his brothers. He worsted about the dream to his father and brothers. His brothers hated Joseph even more. So, Jacob had 12 sons, but like, he loved Joseph the most. Uh, like, he gave Joseph the most delicious food and like the good best clothes. If I am Joseph's brother, I will also be jealous. One day, the, a brother said, let's kill Joseph. Another brother said, don't kill him, let's sell him as a slave. The brother sold Jesus to, oh, Joseph to Midian merchants. Joseph was became a slave in Egypt. So, like the brother were telling, The brothers were saying that let's kill Joseph, but like um, some brothers said, "Oh, sorry, it's wrong to kill." But it's wrong to kill our brothers. So like, they decided to like sell him as a slave. So like, they have. Sell Jesus, Joseph. Joseph came to the house of Potiphar, a gunner of G Egypt. He worked very hard. Jesus was a helpless slave, but God helped him. God blessed the house of Potiphar because of Joseph. One day, something bad happened. Potiphar's wife lied to his husband. He said, Joseph is a bad slave. Potiphar put Joseph in a prison. So, like, Jesus came to the house of Potiphar. And, like, he was a good slave. What, how, what God and God blessed the part of her. And but part of her's wife like wanted Jesus I wanted Joseph to do obey disobey God. So like part of her's wife like lied to his husband. Like he's she said, Joseph is a bad slave. God saw it. God was with Joseph in a prison. Joseph took care of the prisoners. One day, Joseph inter interpreted the dream. Two of prisoners, they were helpers of the king. A few days later, their dream came true. So, God was wet Joseph in, a, in the prison also. And like, Joseph interpreted the dreams also. One night, the Egyptian king had two strange dreams. In one dream, seven skinny cows ate up seven healthy, healthy cows. And... 
another grain, seven dried bundles of grain, eight of seven healthy bundles of grain. What does this mean? The king asked many people. No one could tell him the meaning of the dream. So, uh, one night, like, Paro had a strange dream. Like, so, like, he didn't know the meaning of the dream. He, like, called many wise men and, but also the wise men couldn't, like, tell the meaning of the dream. The king's helper remembered Joseph. He was in jail with Joseph. Joseph can interpret the dream. The king sent for Joseph. The dream means that for the next seven years, you will have good years. You will have harvest plenty of crops. But you will also have seven bad years. You won't have any crops. You must prepare for the fam famine. Said Joseph, the king was very pleased. So, like, finally, the king's helper remembered Joseph. And told about Joseph and also Joseph uh, interpret the dream. The king was amazed and happy with Joseph wisdom. The king said, you're very wise. I want you to rule over my people. The king made Joseph a ruler over Egypt. God took care of me, said Joseph. God was with Joseph. So, God was with Joseph. So, Joseph, now Joseph were ruled over like, the Egypt. And God helped Joseph to be like that. Yes, today I read the Bible story. Did it enjoy the next time I will read chapter 8. Joseph forgive his brothers. Mm, then let's see you next time. Bye.